And hello to our fans online. I'm Rob Nelson. And I'm Sunny Hostin with the top stories on this Friday, July 6th. The survivors are describing chaos on board a crowded yacht that capsized off Long Island, New York, killing three children. 27 people packed onto the boat to watch fireworks Wednesday night. The man piloting that 34-foot boat says lightning cracked and then the boat was slammed by a wave. The three children, two of them cousins, were trapped in the cabin as that yacht sank. The yacht should be recovered from the harbor later today. Police in London are insisting a series of terror-related arrests in the city have no link to the Olympic Games, which begin in less than three weeks. Six terror suspects, five men and a woman, were rounded up in raids that included a home just a mile from Olympic Park. Detectives say they've been tracking the suspects but uncovered no imminent attack plans. A Florida man says he's lucky to be alive because a medallion on a necklace that he was wearing kept a bullet from hitting his chest. 74-year-old Richard Smaldo was watching fireworks on the 4th in a town, ironically, called Safety Harbor when the bullet from somewhere in the crowd slammed into his face. The bullet then traveled toward his chest and was stopped by that medallion, which he recently had engraved with a Bible verse that his mother loved. And when a Missouri homeowner finishes his remodeling project, he'll be able to celebrate in style. That's because he found 95-year-old bottles of whiskey hidden under floorboards in the attic. He says a previous owner was hospitalized for alcoholism and may have hidden the bottles there. A whiskey expert says these pre-prohibition bottles could be sold for several hundred dollars a piece, but the homeowner says he plans to drink the whiskey in five years. That's when the bottles turn 100. I like that idea. <laughs> Save it for a special occasion, yes. the centennial yes. of that whiskey. Make sure you call your favorite news anchors from the overnight when, when you do call us. We'll mm. get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Sunny Hostel. And I'm Rob Nelson. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great weekend. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it.